Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be doing a planner setup for this gorgeous file effects in front of me. So I did a setup of my personal planner a couple of months ago, which I'll leave a link for in the description at the end at the end of this video. So if you want to check that out, let me know. And you guys have been requesting planner videos ever since then. So I thought I would show you this one. Now this is the one that I use when I'm at university because even though personal um, size file effects aren't particularly big, I have to carry in textbooks and notebooks and uh, laptops and stuff. So I prefer to have something like this, which is nice and small. So it's actually the pocket file effects. Um, in it's a Finsbury and it's in grey. Oh, this is getting all tangled up. Um, and it's this gorgeous like pebbled leather, and I absolutely love it. And I got it for about half price, I believe, um, from TK Maxx. And it's got a dent in it, which was actually my doing when I actually got it from TK Maxx. It was pristine, so I was so happy to find it. So I thought I'd just get on with it. So I'm going to start with the charms. So the charms on here are all actually made and sold by me. So these two are acrylics and then there is another clay charm in here as well. So if you want to check out my shop then I'll leave a link in the description box. You may see some stuff about my YouTube and my shop in here so I thought I'd just let you know. So the first one is this mint, uh, what's it called, macaroon which literally came in today. I just um, I just got these back from production. It's my new macaroon collection and these are just acrylic plastic charms and I am so excited about these. These won't be available until mid-April um, around the, I want to say the 20th, 19th, that kind of time. But I got these and I couldn't help but put one on because I think mint and grey look so good together um, even though it doesn't really match my other charms. So that is that one. So it's a little macaroon and that's just one of the colours that I will be selling. So the other charms at the bottom are these ones. So I have got this, again, it's an acrylic charm. This one, it's plastic. So I've got this really, really cute post-it note charm. And then the other one is kind of stuck inside. There we go. Is a little polymer clay heart, um, heart star. So I'll open it up and you can see it a little bit better. So it yeah, looks like this. Super, super cute. And I think yellow and gray also go really well together, even though the inside is kind of themed minty and blue. Um, I just think yellow and gray look so pretty together. So yeah, that's the, like, the outside of the file of X and stuff. I don't keep a pen in it because the pens I use are the friction pilot pens and they don't fit in this silly little pen loop because it's not elasticated, which is really upsetting, but I always have pens with me usually when I go to uni and stuff. So that doesn't bother me too much. So yeah, I'll just get onto what's inside this now. So this is what it looks like. Um, th the one thing that I don't like about this is that Finsbury's don't lie flat, unlike all of the other planners I've ever owned, but they're so gorgeous, you kind of forgive them for it, but I hate the fact that it doesn't lie flat, so I'm gonna have to hold that for you. So this is just my dashboard and the inside stuff. So on this side, I just have some stamps. I don't tend to use these stamps, but when I'm at uni, I, I send home uh, birthday cards and Mother's Day cards and things like that. So that's what I use those for. So it's nice just to have them in here. Another thing in here is this adorable little owl clip from Bonbon bon Kawaii, um, which is where I get a lot of my stationery. This um, memory pad is also from Bonbon bon Kawaii, so I'll leave the links down below. And here is one of my business cards. If you haven't seen them before, I'll get it out. Oops, it's kind of a tight fit. This is actually one of the old business cards. Um, I changed the back, um, but that's meant to be me. Hello. Um, and then this is just what it looks like. So it's got some cute little treats on it because I'm actually known for making a fake food jewelry, not acrylic charms, but that's just the way that goes. I don't actually have any of that on my planner. Um, I have one of those, I have a cupcake on my other personal planner. This is actually a SIM card. I recently got an iPhone 6 and, um, but my contract for my, other like phone contract hasn't ended yet so I'm still using that one and this is my new one that starts in May I think so I'm just keeping in that that in here so that I know exactly where it is and I don't have to worry about that so onto my dashboard my dashboard is just a piece of um it's the dashboard that comes with it and I have this really adorable little memo pad that's hiding the ugly sticky mark that the Filofax sticker left and then here I'm really not the type of person to keep these kind of things in a planner I think it's kind of cringy personally you can obviously do it but I kind of think having pictures and stuff is cringy but this the colors of this kind of went so well and I don't know, it's a really old picture of my boyfriend and I, and I got a bunch of these um, printed. They're from, I can never remember the website name, but I will leave it in the description. Um, I got it printed from Instagram, and it's a very old picture of my boyfriend and I. Um, and I don't know, I just, I just really like it, and I can't put them up in my room at uni because my room is really damp. So I really wanted to put them somewhere, so I have a couple of these in here, but this is just my boyfriend and I, and it's um, attached with this cute little mint clip. So that's just the dashboard. Here is my first little, well, it's not even a tab, it's... Um, 
I guess it's the tab, I guess. It's just to make my dashboard look pretty, basically, and I love the papers of these. I don't know where they're from, I'm afraid. I've forgotten, but um, they're really gorgeous, and I need to laminate them when I go home. But this just has, like, uh, the 2015 look, and then it's got some personal information, like what happens if it gets lost. So the next tab is my diary, and I, like I said, I love this paper. It's got, like, hashtags, and, oh, I just love it. So this is what the back of that looks like. And then here is just my diary. So this is this week. It's actually Friday today, I haven't actually filled it in, which is kind of stupid. But yeah, so this is what it looks like, and I just have the Firefax black ruler. So yeah, I prefer my pages bright, colourful, and full of stuff. I kind of use this as a to-do list, um, rather than... Actually, to be fair, I use all of my um, plans as more like to-do lists, so I will fill it out, it's kind of like this, this one's kind of empty. And then I will go in with Studio L2E stamps um, and stamp some uh, to-do lists like this. So I will have decorated this and then I add the stamps. And then I also, as I go, add um, other stickers, so like cats, because I was filming at an animal rescue centre. And then like pill there and just things that I'll add in quickly. Um, and then like stickers like this. So it's Patrick's Day, so I put a sticker there. So I like do overall design like this. It's usually just washi tape and a couple of stickers it's kind of hard to decorate a, a pocket file effects because they're so small um but yeah so it looks like this and then like i said i got little teddy bears and i love this washi tape it's new um same with this one so as you can see i sort of follow the same plan and then i fill it in as i go um hey, it's my birthday and i do like a couple of weeks in advance because i'm the type of person that if it's not decorated i won't use it um and it has to be nice and bright and colorful otherwise i won't look at it um yeah so that's just like the the rule that i follow i don't particularly decorate too much i just yeah, I just tend to do a little bit and then just fill it in as I go. And like I said, I use friction pens. Sorry the lighting in this video is changing so much. The weather today is deciding to be crazy. But uh, the next tab is school. So I can't really show you this because all that's in there right now is just information on a house that I'm moving into next year for university. And that's literally it. I really should put more in there. But right now I don't really have anything because it's coming to the end of my second year. And I love this paper. It's like a wood pattern. So then the tab after that is full of hashtags which I love because it's like YouTube and Instagram it's all my social media and stuff so if you flip this over I love this color um so just like in my personal planner I have a a page where I track my Instagram followers which I I started doing it 16k I started noticing about 10k that my followers were going up really quickly and I really wanted to track them so this page is really fun because my subscribe uh, my followers were going up so much um and then I've just unlike my personal planner I didn't make a different page for a different year I just carried on um and my followers on Instagram have been slowing down because I haven't been able to upload as much because of university but I will get back on track but they're still going ridiculously much so I just I'm about to hit 48,000 I believe I'm very close I'm to 47.9 so that should be coming tomorrow or the next day hopefully which is really exciting because I'm so close to 50 it's so amazing so if you want to follow me on Instagram go do that um but then I've just got uh, like I said I've just sort of decorated it quickly and then I've got YouTube so I've got a page for tutorials back to basics and other video ideas and I can actually take this one off because it's my planner setup so um how I made the tops of these is they're just really cheap stamps from eBay and they're just like wooden stamps and they come with all types of letters and you can get them in different fonts but I absolutely love this one. And then the last tab here is um, the same as that back one but in a pretty pink colour and it is notes and miscellaneous. So I have like goals for 2015. I don't do resolutions because I think they're too permanent so I just write goals and add the two it, like throughout the year. I have a full one in my personal planner if you want to have a look at my goals. Um, I just haven't been able to find time to write them all down in here. So that needs completing. This is just a wish list of loads of a bunch of things that I want. So a new desk, lots of expensive makeup and other stuff. And then here's a list of books that I need to read, which isn't very long, but I'm going on holiday and I tend to read loads of books when I'm on holiday. So that is just what I'm doing for that. And then it's just to-do list paper, blank paper that comes with it. So all the colored ones. And then I have an address bit at the back it comes with thousands of these pages and um, and they mostly have my online friends addresses so people from youtube instagram people i want to send products to to put on their instagram or blog and stuff that all goes in here because um i don't know i, I like to have those written down whereas i know my friends addresses off by heart or you know i can walk and give them something rather than send them something you know what i mean so 
yes loads of these are dress things um it's basically this whole thing is basically not in use um all of this back bit is not in use but i like having it to bulk out the planner and then this is just a frosted open uh, top opening pocket from filofax and it has a couple more of those prints in there from instagram um these prints are such good quality if i didn't mention that before they're like a matte you know when something feels so good they just feel so good so this is my best friend becca who's um in a different university to me as well as my best friend charlie who's in this other photo i don't know i just i don't really look at them like i don't flick to this page but i think it's really sweet just to like see them in the back of my planner because i don't get to see them very often because my best friend has now sort of moved to the um like moved permanently to the city where she goes to university so um yeah and my my other best friend is in wales so it's quite a long distance so actually i'll just leave this out um and then on the other side is a print from sharadactyl on instagram and she makes the most gorgeous gorgeous prints and stickers and pin badges and stuff so this is well i guess it's dr frankenstein's monster's wife um to get it correct so she's like eating a donut she's on the phone and it's just like this mini print and she signed the back and it's in this protective case and i just i didn't have anywhere to put this and i thought this would be great and i love it sort of goes with the colors as well i think gray goes with everything to be honest but I think it looks so cute. So yeah, I've just got one of these and this came in like a Halloween set. She does sets where she, it's like a mini print, a sticker and a badge and something else I think. And she's just released like a mermaid dessert collection and there's like a mermaid whose tail is like a crepe. I, I died, so I accident, accidentally bought another one of those. So that should be coming to me soon. So I'm so excited, I'm not gonna lie. It's gonna be so cool. So I forgot to mention at the beginning, but fi uh, Finsbury's come with a pocket at the top and then a pocket at the side. And the only thing I have in here is a charm that was first on this when I first got it. It's one of my really old oh, clay charms and it's really tiny and I don't know why I still have them in here. It's kind of like turned into a good luck charm now. And it's a tiny little stone with a face on it. There we go. He's absolutely teeny tiny, but he was the first charm that I put on this. And so I like to have him in there. And he's, like I said, my little lucky charm now. I just like to have him in there. And I forget sometimes, so it's really nice to just, to, just to come across him. And then back here, I just have a coupon, some labels, and some customs forms somewhere. Just in case I'm going to the post office or something like that, or I've got to pack the order at my boyfriend's house because I need to rush out of the house, something like that. Um, and they're just there um just in case i don't have them so yeah that's all of my all that's in my pocket finsbury now i'm really sorry i talked really fast throughout this video the lighting is disappearing and i'm sorry the lighting also has been a bit funny in this video but i hope you enjoyed this and if you want to see more planner videos let me know give this video a like so i know what you want to see if you want to check out my last setup video, click on the screen now. Also, if you want to check out my planner charms, you can check out my shop, which is Kawaii Studios on Etsy, and I'll leave all the links down below for all my social media and my shop. So I really hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.